He basically just holds up a dollar, you know, like it's a donation to the troop. Police Chief Steve Aldrich says Jonathan Williams lured the 13-year-old Boy Scout, who, with his troop, was outside this Holly Hill Ace Hardware fundraising. Williams left the store after making a purchase, according to officers, then sat in this van in the parking lot, staring at the boys and touching himself. Williams allegedly waved the victim over with the promise of a dollar bill. A guy just called one of my scouts to his car, and he had his private part out and showed it to my 13-year-old scout. When he opened the door, the, the individual is right there. He fully exposed himself. A license plate reader captured the van and its tag as the driver left the area. Police say the van Williams was driving is owned by the Free Spirit Evangelist Outreach Church on Indigo Drive. We get the people that most people don't want. Pastor Ruth Plummer says her church regularly ministers to sex offenders and others with troubled pasts. Suspect Williams, who she calls JW, joined in 2012, driving the van, delivering food, cooking. Whatever happened to him, and wherever this went at, it was very, yeah, it wasn't like JW. Pastor Plummer says Williams was never unsupervised around children and, as far as she knows, followed all terms of his probation, even wearing an ankle monitor. But police say Williams himself admitted the behavior. According to the report, the suspect said he fell off of the wagon. And I could cry. That's not my JW. Not the man you have been ministering to. Right. Back live now. Police say very obviously the young victim was upset, as was the entire scout troop and the folks who work at this Ace Hardware. They allow the Boy Scouts frequently to raise money here. They provided surveillance that police say helped make the case. The suspect, Mr. Williams, is being held without bond. We're live in Holly Hill, Volusia County. Claire Metz, West News. All right, Claire, thank you.